Yeah. Oh, look, cancelled. Wow. Hi, Thomas Gio. <coughs> Why would you play Hansel so early, Mr. Opponent? Treka. And there's a. You only missed 27 provisions. 27 is much better. Um, so, Krach. Uh, might as well move a ship if opportunity presents itself. Uh, we have uh, double consume, triple consume. No, I think you go Pallor. Well, we don't have the heatwave interaction, and I don't think Sporsa of any value here. No Giga Toads, so we have the Giga Rad though, so are you really sad or are you just faking it? The, wait, you finished the village? I, I, I've seen Chase play on Slot on stream as well. Bruh, we. Oh, uh, sure, I forgot about. Not everyone is playing with front row ships. So, a bit of a mishap. It's a really short game. Yeah, you, you spent 50 hours on it though, so. Game being short means nothing. You uh, you streamed in forever in Discord. Um, so yeah, the Drowner would have been pretty nice. Opponent also gets uh, the Terror into the hand or Krach. Is it a table seven? Uh, hopefully we are, uh, we are playing some uh, Dark Souls today. Still have a dragon to beat. Before beating the, the game and moving to the next one. Most likely being blasph uh, Blasphemous. But maybe it takes like three streams to beat the dragon and then there is a finish uh, final boss that takes even more. A leader charge? A leader charge. Uncried! My dear, my beloved, yeah, I spent the S3 bosses. Yeah, 65 attempts on Gale. So something broke uh, in between and I didn't progress at all. Buna sera, Elke. How is the weather? Are you enjoying it? Why are we falling behind on points? Hello? Can, can we slam some V's already? A 10. At one point I was building a program that could play V. I wondered, uh, wondered brain that program reached pro with it, never finished because hunger got nerfed. I think your quote played, but it was hidden behind the music. I might be mistaken. We don't have anything to squirrel.
I did log in into the bot, right? Yeah. It's not hello mark, it's hi mark. My dude. Yeah. The quote should have played. It's literally in the folder and in the program. Also, if any of you are not in a possession of a quote, but you want some and you are a sub, you can get one. Yeah, I think your quote played. It's just four seconds long. How it works, the quote. The first time you speak, it plays automatically. So you need to have the sound on. The fuck? You have to teach me how to put that. Uh, it's with the Streamlabs chatbot, so yeah, sure, hit me up. It's uh, not really all that advanced. It's not the first time though. You already asked Wholesome to go live. So this is where we tro troll portal, right guys? The porter goes first, erases the golden hand. I also not sure what volume you, I put your quote to. It's 60. Okay, it's 69% now. Erdems is also at 70. Don't really want to play Villa. Also, V is in deck, right? Oh, no, no. <laughs> what the fuck is the reporter doing in this hand? Man, look at it. Also, opponent is a possession of more quirks, so... We have a slight problem here. Troll needs a range stability. Yeah, true. Discard your opponent's deck. If it's below 10 cards, just discard everything from opponent's deck. Seems reasonable. Uh, do we? We don't play this because it's pointless. Play a neutral legendary card. Do I want to matter? Play maybe. Maybe it just fits his birna. Consume the lowest power unit. You guys have some nice ideas of how how to not change troll porter honestly. Well, 
Wait, it consumes, right? I'm not that stupid. I should have clicked though. To play around. They're open while playing V. What's wrong with that? Excuse moi. Uh, do I hunt for quacks? Or trees to replace a uh, troll? And once again, do I aim at Quack? So do I take V? Yeah, that might have been uh, a mistake. Wax pulls what? That's the question. The Krach is out. Fuku is out. It might be nothing uh, too essential. Summons highest uh, unit to the row, so not To the left or right. Eh, fine. Kinda breaks his compass. This is a, a provision card though, so whatever they are playing, everything is at their hand. Maybe take more work, yeah, and the more work uh, being in in the deck is uh, logical, so it was a nice attempt, that's why I went for it. But uh, as we see, not really consequential, a oh, heat wave as well. So we go into round three, two cards down. Uh, we'll, we'll have like three Vs at the very least. Do we even bleed further? Mm. So the compass is not giving them more work, more work is in hand. Fuku is out. Bite, baited by Ronian. Not Mia. Miamon didn't even play V at that moment, but uh, I already got baited by Ronian, so this is not going too well. <coughs> but Ronian isn't even here. Yeah, I got the decklist from him ages ago. This is not a consume unit! Why have so many Vs if you cannot even digest them all? Slice it. Is just getting erased. Oh well, unfortunate. Unfortunate for Slizard. He 
Eating centipedes is bad for your health. Uh, what is this uh, nonsense science? It's not confirmed. There is literally no, no reason for, to go for bar has right? So we're just losing, unless there's Jenki the Regary, we can just float V, we have the power in hand. What's the point though? I'm wasting a. Uh, like, with Barhest in hand, I could have done this and purified. Then you, you know, it uh, doesn't help him, it goes back into the deck. Wholesome is not a V player confirmed. Well, yeah, it doesn't really change anything. We are still playing three Vs overall. Still lots of points. Uh, what's a royal decree? He's, yeah, he's playing nice cards though. Incredible tempo. Uh, the terror of the seas. Uh, we played into the longship round one. We are playing into longship now. Hi, Andy. So we consume once. Um, we tutor another V. Uh, Forktail doesn't do anything. Uh, spores do not do anything. New deck V. Uh, hopefully. Although so far it's uh, not really successful. We are some points ahead though. Opponent definitely has Mork in hand, maybe Spores, maybe he continues playing the long ships though. Ah wait, yeah, so we know that there is a Terror and Mork work in his hand. Uh, so one is playing for... Uh, what, 20, 30 points, the second is playing for 20 points, that's 50. Make it uh, incredibly close. If he has tier clear, we... Uh, wait, we play, he plays, we play, he tier with yeah, we cannot play around that. For some second I thought we can. We were two cards down, not one card down. <coughs> so 50 extra points in his hand. He wins by 5. A Spores is playing for 8. Wow, the Spores is actually the best card to pick. <laughs> Dude.
and it ties if it's exactly 50 points of course uh if he runs compass and he kept it well yeah that that's not incredible so that's a 30 point play and then he gets another point on his uh, terror of the seas but i'm not so that it has uh like 17 armor on it yeah and it's still freaking ties <laughs> my mouth was uh well on point So Imblurit's Wrath is the only Toll Punish they have. They might have Parasite though. I'm not felt here. Uh, it, speaking realistically of uh, like cool new god decks, Probably you can play uh, the status new god. Uh, my mon Celia, I think, played some version of it to some success. So yeah, devo devotion version with masquerade ball is probably your best. Uh, not a simulate list. There is nothing taller than a seven, right? Kicker poison and then the new god golden necker you can still run it without iron dyed but is it as fun i highly doubt it wait why is this ranged locked unacceptable also should we <laughs> we shouldn't really pull the old spear tip out of his deck or should we does it even work with uh... a tutor into tutor is a big mistake, of course. Okay, Oberon. Another early appearance. How is it that 18 point uh, units are allowed? Well, our V is only 13, I'm not sure, but here we are. Quax. Uh, Quax is a card after all. I guess we are going a card down. Well, this is a um, a devotion frost we're talking about, so hopefully manageable in a long run, especially without Oberon. I would have preferred to having a squirrel here. Uh, well, 
I guess we can keep trees, but it's such a nice carry overplay. Um, so I'm playing trees, I'm gaining the V in hand. But at the same time, I'm uh, limiting my chances to V, uh, to find V in hand. Yeah, that's what I'm considering if I'm wasting this or not. So this is playing for four. And damage, we are taking some frost. After playing Forktail, I was panicking a bit because uh, Winter Queen exists. It didn't matter here, but I lost to Winter Queen uh, like two weeks ago. Is that over yet? There is no meaning to this porter. Uh, this is much better. It's no V, plus we need uh, something to send back into the deck. I'm playing the squirrel. His second best Osrel is uh, a seven point Osrel. So we are two cards down, but he is a Devotion Frost player. Why, without Oberon and without Ozreal, what does it spell for us? Probably a possibility to, to play at least a little bit. I also should have played this back row because, well, we have Mata and Tris, so... Maybe I'll learn later. Today is not the day. Здорово, Тайни. Что ты сегодня завтра работаешь? О, oh, look at that. Would you look at that? <coughs> Yep, okay. Why do we have only six cards? An opponent had nine. What scary numbers are those? So, shortening around, getting like his leader charge and whatnot is still cool. We'll get his wrath as well, apparently. <laughs> this stress is so bad, though. Like, she does absolutely nothing for us. I can take, uh, wait, I have to send something back to draw a card, so I cannot even buff the V. Naglefar, it's uh, one of those two, and Trollporter, so it's once again a bit of a waste. I think we are growing V and getting his wrath out. Yeah. La da da. So 
So echo card, Eridin. Another Foglet potentially, although I'm not sure if they're running two. We still haven't seen Winter Queen out. But uh, playing here is just a waste of Vs and he probably has a couple of bronzes as an, uh, an L Conqueror. That is uh, not really working in our favor. Why not play three snow and send one of the tutors back into the deck? I'd rather have a tutor than a V in my hand. Maybe. Like, sure, we could have played another card, but uh, I might also take the last mulligan and get a fortune teller, so I'd rather uh, get a V out of that. I don't really see the difference between playing it and trading it for bronze or just keeping it as is. A troll porter. What's your task? If we draw like this, I wouldn't mind one of them. Ah, Nitro is enjoyer as well. We can send uh, Bar Barbie back into the deck and bring it as a nine. That definitely helps, right? Right? Uh, this is just the white frost and neutral charge or echo card or that. So yeah, it never survives. Shit. Same goes to the Barbie. Also not sure we're playing Prince. Because it can bring us throw porter. So maybe we trace Devotion doesn't have a lock. Thinking as a V player. Well, I don't see us rolling over any opponent so far. So if you guys have uh, a meaningful advice, I'm always happy to listen to it so that we actually start winning some games. Uh, if not, I'm gonna continue roping. As simple as that. Uh, what are we deciding? Uh... 
Um, we have enough consumes as is. What are you damaging my V for? We did nothing wrong. Well, maybe an occasional city destruction and stuff, but other than that... That's uh, some points. Uh, this is the opponent that we squirreled, right? So we still Aussie. Aussie playing for eight. Okay, so a 31 point V, imagine hand buffing V for no reason, it should be eaten, Ironian, easy, uh, if we are winning and well, we should, especially with like meeting his Oberon, it will be the first win for the deck. I struggled in the first three games. We lost twice and tied once, but yeah, wasn't the smoothest travel for us so far. Okay, wow. But it says uh, what you expect from playing against Frost. <laughs> 